Hello, Jay Mario here, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Last we left off, we went in to the same place where we got the uh, the strange relic with Sebastian. He done killed his uncle, being stupid. But we decided not to turn him in with uh, and uh, we also found the Snidgets. We helped them, and uh, that Doesn't was matter, that was much of a pain. I hope he can help me craft the Keeper's wand. I gotta craft this special wand. Wait. Oh, I have to wait. Alright. So another day, so let's get into it. What the world? What, did it not start already? What is what is happening? What the world? There we go. Hello, Mr. Ollivander. I wondered if you might be able to help me with something. Good to see you, my young Ravenclaw friend. Allow me once again to express my family's gratitude. They were pleased to learn that the wand Richard Jackdaw disappeared with those many years ago had been located, even if it was somewhat unusable. Glad to hear it. Now, I received an owl from Eleazar, uh, Professor Fig. He was a bit cryptic, said you need to have a special wand crafted, that you'd bring me the materials. Yes, sir. I have them here. Oh, my. How extraordinary. Remarkable design. I will be honest, I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is... Something else entirely. Keeping me on my toes, aren't you? I think I can work with what you've brought me. Let me see what I can do. It is done. Oh, that's looking nice. I should warn you, I've never seen a one like this before. My suspicion, as Professor Fig implied in his letter, is that it serves a unique purpose. I doubt you shall find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you, sir. I'm afraid you're on your own. I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. Oh, come, come. No need for such theatrics. In light of what Ranrock now knows, you must agree that our interests are aligned. Our interests will never be aligned. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours? The final repository belongs to wizard kind. We would be fools not to work together. What's that you've got there? None of your business. Might this sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? Bro, we don't no go ahead and deposo him already. Send him flying. Pack this man up. That repository is my birthright. Shop man, I'm about to fold you. You near it. <laughs> the arrogance. Should have known better than to try and reason with a child. Well, what you about to do? I've always said children should be seen and not heard. Bye, 
Have a great time. Oh, what? Bro, I just got taken. I didn't know that could happen. Man, this is about to be easy. In the music. Well, I can't hit you with that. Man, it's easy. What you about to do? No. Bro, you can't beat me, man. You don't go away. Garbage. You. Oh, didn't mean that. We got her. Here you go. Woo. No. Man, who is hitting me with the Patricia for power? Man, hit me with it too. Oh my god. Hey, go there. I didn't mean to do I keep doing that. Brian's not even doing that, bro. It's frozen. Uh, come here. Goodbye. Oh man. I really try. Bro, there's no way you can beat me, man. I can't really hit you. Are they walking? No more happy days for you. Woo! Woo! Oh, 
Woo! Oh my god. Nope. Woo! Oh. Where? Hit me with the two? Oh my god. Finish him. Oh, fin Bro, there ain't no way you beating me, man. Bro, I didn't even have a champ. Oof. Boy, exploded. Well, Rookwood's dead. I can't believe it. Rookwood's reign is finally over. I need to send an Alpha Natty right away. For now, though. I need to get back to the map chamber and tell Fig what happened. I really took my man out the game like that. Victor Rookwood is dead. He confronted me as I left Ollivander's with the Keeper's Wand. I had to defend myself. Godric's heart. Are you all right? I know you're well able to defend yourself. I've seen it often enough. But Rookwood himself... He would have killed me once he found the repository, if not before. I had no choice. You're right. You had no choice. You did what you had to do. The wizarding community owes you a great debt. Thank you for saying so, Professor. I'm ready for what's next. All right, then. The Keepers have been waiting. You have completed all of our trials, and you have done so under circumstances even I did not foresee. You understand now why all of this was necessary. The port key, the vault, the locket, the book, the trials. To ensure that one with the ability you and I share would make the same choice that San, Neve, Charles, and I did. Now that you have witnessed my memory, you understand all that is at stake. Not everyone is what they seem. As you know, light does not exist without shadow, nor shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Even the most well-meaning and competent amongst us cannot possibly know the consequences of manipulating what should be beyond our reach. What lies in the repository must never be released. Resist the temptation to destroy or control it. The magic that you have so carefully honed must now be used only to protect the secret we keep. You have the wand. You will know when to wield it. We leave our legacy in your hands. So you know on facts that I'm gonna destroy that thing, right? Y'all know I'm gonna destroy it, 100%. Because like, there is no reason to keep that thing around when obviously somebody next is gonna try and get it. going there we can only hope that we're not too late and that we find nothing but a repository undisturbed beyond this door it's a possibility oh yeah if you also see I maxed out my ancient meter I found all the uh, ancient magic hotspots actually kind of couldn't find them I had to go flying around casting Revelio for a long time I should hope that the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion from below. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you they will in the future. Were you able to reach Professor Weasley? I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we entered. Okay. 
There's the drill. If the Royalists are here, it cannot be far behind. You and I have faced worse, Professor. You mean I face worse? I'm out here fighting trolls. Whoa, didn't want to get hit by that. This drill stands between us and him. We need to move it. Now I shall handle it. One. Let's go. A good bit of the pulsar right there. Roll him. What is that? An armored troll? You know what? Transform you. Barrel. Handle with it. Ooh. Rolling back. Oh. Oh, I thought you were done. You will not take what is not yours. Exactly. Tell them. Crawler. Keep going. Roll. You can't defeat me, man. I do like thousands of damage. A dead end. Oh no, I gotta check. Am I playing on hard? I don't know why, but I need to check. I feel real bad if this is not okay. It is. It is on hard. I'm about to say. I'm out here again. I'm thinking like the whole time. I'm doing a lot of damage here. Like I know I upgraded all my stuff to max, but still, I'm doing a lot of damage. Professor, that wall. That's the way forward. Very It worked. Let's go. All right. I fear you're right, Professor. There's nothing we can do but keep searching. Listen, more goblins up ahead. Not worried about that. Oh, dang. I'm talking about that. Take that. These tunnels haven't brought us much luck so far. We're getting closer, Professor. That way. Ember. Oh, here comes the cavalry. The goblins have somehow evaded the castle's defensive charms. Get 
Busting through. We're in a thick of it now. We'll show you speak to your charge. Oh, that works out. Thank you, Professor. Wrong spell. Oh, it's out. Ah, oh, this one. It hit the wrong one. Just keep rolling. All right, that's that done. What? We're out. That's not the one I want to... Hit him! Oh, he waited! Oh! Oh, you playing those games? He actually waited. Oh my god. Man, finish him off. Hadouken! Here we are. Oh, we got to fight two of those at once. Well, that seemed to have worked out. We made it. I'm relieved we got here before Ranrock. I can't believe this is it. The repository has been under the castle for hundreds of years. 
Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. What Isadora showed you. You are now the Keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? Nah, I kind of wish I saved. I kind of want to destroy it. Would that be opening it? You might as well just contain it here. I mean... I plan to leave the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking... What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her, and the others, sooner. Trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? I keep it secret for now. I plan to keep it secret for now. But in time, when I am ready, I plan to tell those I trust everything and accept their help. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. There he is. Of Thanos. Kind. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container, all of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <coughs> Seems you two of a kind. She didn't know when to give up either. <laughs> Well, that's not good. No world. Is that a dragon? Okay. You can't, stop me. you can't stop me. What you about to do? What you about to do? That's a note.
Man, I know exactly what I'm doing. The one. Oh my god. Cool. Oh, Let me I'm not close enough to hit it. Oh my god. Oh no, 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 no. What's that one? Yellow. Too late. I should really use my distant one. Woo! What's that one? I just died. <laughs> Hit him, finish him. What the world? Oh my god. Uh, no, not the Akio there. Bro, I'm about to die. I'm about to die again. I'm about to die again. It's stoked. Oh my god. I didn't hit it fast enough. Oh my god. What? I gotta look up to see it. That is not the correct one. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ain't no way, cuz. Okay. Okay. Please. No, just go. Hit it. Woo. Is that it? Hey, trophy, the hero of Hogwarts. I could have sworn I thought he was dead.
young friend. The wizarding world could not be in more capable hands. Dang. That's unfortunate. So now what happens? <coughs> Professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you, certainly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge, he built a reputation... charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig, well, I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can, by wisely, resourcefully, Justly and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig. I can't believe we lost Fig. I didn't know him as well as you did, but I know he was a good man. Glad Weasley spoke for him. She honored him well. Fig will be well remembered. I wish the same could have been done for my uncle. I wonder if there's a chance Anne would meet me. Sebastian, I can't imagine what you and Anne are going through. Perhaps you'll hear from her soon. I hope so. I, I'll let you know. Sebastian. There's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait. What? What are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. This... this can't be. It was the Loyalists. It's always been them. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her. And she's never been the same. So cruel. Rookwood deserved what he got. 
Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you an apology. All this time I thought goblins were the enemy. But it was never that simple. Ominous said he's spoken with Anne. I wonder if she'll see me. I'll find out and send word when I know more. Alright then, now we went from winter, we then went full circle. Now what? Congratulations, you completed the story of Hogwarts Legacy and reached the end of your school year. With your OWL exams fast approaching, now it's a good time to reveal your field guide progress, explore the world, finishing the remaining relationship storylines, and side quests, and complete your field guides as you see fit. Alright. Oh, that's that. Uh. So what? Do I got any mail? Is that it? I don't think there's anything else. Oh yeah, there is. Prepare for your OWLs. Really? There's more? Hey, I thought... End of the game. End of the game. No, I got OWLs. Wait, am I really about to have to take a test? Am I playing Persona right now? I ain't go out and get none of these things. Okay, meet Poppy in the Great Hall. Say less. Alright, meet with Sebastian first. I'm glad you came. Sebastian, I've received your owl. What's happened? Ominous spoke with Anne about what happened with my Uncle Solomon. She believes I should pay for what I did. But she won't turn me in. She said the guilt I'll have to live with is punishment enough. I'm so sorry. But I'm glad you know that you can at least try to move on now. The thing is, I think I've lost my sister. My twin. Forever. She refuses to even see me. I can't blame her. I couldn't really blame any of you if you gave up on me entirely. You all believed in me, and I let you all down. Anne may just need some time. Surely one day she'll be able to forgive you. I hope you're right. I realize I can't undo what's been done, but I can try every day to make up for it. I owe you an ominous everything for standing by me. Well, it wasn't easy. But I believe in you, Sebastian. I've had a sense about you since that first day in Defense Against the Dark Arts. Seems so long ago. Thank you. I have no idea what's to come, but... I'm grateful for your friendship. I'm glad you came to Hogwarts. There we go. And I got a trophy. A sallow grave. Now I gotta meet with Poppy. Just the person I was hoping to see. I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the smidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the centaurs. And... I wanted to thank you when the poachers ambushed us. I... It was nice not to face them alone. Of course. It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so. I am glad you came to Hogwarts. It's already been my best year. I wouldn't want a repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the Three Broomsticks. Had no idea how lovely it was there. Had you never been to the Three Broomsticks? I used to spend most of my time with Highwing, and, well, I don't know how Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. Highwing's the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Nothing wrong with that. Highwing's good company. She is. Although I am beginning to see the appeal of, uh, human friends. It was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. And share Highwing. Does your gran know that we found the Snidgets? I couldn't hold it in any longer. I told her everything. She was livid that I'd been anywhere near the poachers. But she confessed that she was rather envious about the Snidgets. I don't suppose you've heard anything from your parents, have you? I haven't, but I'm perfectly fine with that. 
It has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. Don't know that I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. And with centaurs as allies, I might actually go looking for trouble. You and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Perhaps Highwing can join us? Alright, that's another one. I got another trophy. Beast. Friends. Now let's deal with Harlow. Are you ready to finish Harlow? Yes, I am. I'm ready to finish Harlow once and for all. What is your plan? I received an owl from Mrs. Bickle. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. Suggested we could gather evidence from a friend near Manor Cape. But she warned us to stay out of it. Was rather adamant about it. Precisely. Harlow knows that we saved Archie. And that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from Mrs. Bickle, did it? I do not believe it did. Harlow intends to ambush us. But now we have the upper hand. We can prepare. We are stronger than Harlow, and he knows it. That's why he's resorting to this sort of trickery. We must go. Agreed. Let's finish this. Brilliant. Harlow's reign ends today. Perhaps we ought to inform Officer Singer of our plans. I already sent her an owl to let her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Are you concerned she might tell your mother? Indeed she will, but so be it. I am tired of hiding it from her. My mother needs to understand that I will not be safe from the Ashwinders until everyone is. I shall pursue them until they are finished, and I think she knows that. As do you. That I do. I sense he is close. Where is he? I do not know. What the world? How do you say on that? You shut up. Oh, Theophilus Harlow. It's time to become Little the folded. I, it? And her excruciatingly loyal companion. Man, go ahead and pack him up. done quite a bit of damage to my business interests. <laughs> but... I must gradually give you some credit. What was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic. Fortunately, I pride myself on my problem-solving skills. Hmm. Yeah, it's talking all that talk. Ooh, ouch.
All right. That Crucio ain't no joke. It take all your health away. You be stuck with 1% health. Hey, got another quest acting on instinct. Are you sure you are up for a visitor? Yes, mother. I feel fine. And it will do me good to see my friend. Very well. But do not overdo it, Natsai. I know, mother. It is good to see you, my friend. I'm glad to see you're doing so well. I am doing better than it appears. I am only here because my mother insisted just to be safe. I was relieved when she told me that you were all right. Only because of you. How are you feeling? <laughs> well, I've had better days. But Nurse Blaney says that I am on the mend. I'm sorry, Natty. It's my fault you got hurt. What? No. Do not blame yourself for this. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... You did what came naturally. I suppose it was instinct. Yes. I could not simply stand there and let you get hurt. Then I shouldn't feel guilty. Of course not. There was nothing that you... Oh. Oh my... I cannot believe that it took me this long to see it. He made a choice based on instinct. My father, you, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what I know of him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. That's very kind of you to say. I hope that you are right. This has all been a bit much, hasn't it? A battle here at Hogwarts Everything we have done to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot. But we have done it. Rookwood is dead, Harlow is on his way to Azkaban, and the rest of them are on the run. A few of the dregs will still be about, fighting for their lost cause. But Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. Everything is safer now because of us. Because of you. Thank you, but we make a formidable team. You, my fellow traveler, have enriched my time at Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. Thank you. I believe your friendship to be one of the most important in my life. Thank you for coming to visit me. It is always good to see you. Got another trophy, the Avenging Gazelle. So that's the end of her storyline as well. That's the two. Huh. Can I do it again? Yeah. One more time. What sort of world are we in where children solve no, well. problems? Well, it is what it is. Unfortunately, y'all ain't strong enough like me. The Chosen. Well, let me get out of here. I'm at the end of this episode here. Next one. I'm preparing for my OWLs. And I, I'm pretty sure I hope it's not like Persona. And I was supposed to pay attention to my, uh, my field guides. Because uh, if I was supposed to... It's over. But until the next one, Frederick Douglass out.